Krista. Formula One recently released a statement regarding Andretti's proposal to enter Formula One. With their assessment, they deemed Andretti to be unfit to join Formula One as the 11th entrant as they believe the team wouldn't add any value to the sport. And I can't help but to think of it to be the most insane claim to make. The team that has virtually won and has consistently put effort to mark their identity in any motorsport that they partake in and has a Formula 1 world champion like Mario Andretti as the owner, how could it already not add value to the sport that they have interest to join? This entire assessment just sounds so ridiculous. On top of it, the team is also being backed by an American automobile giant like General Motors, with Cadillac ready to support the team in their venture into Formula 1 by sponsoring the team and becoming an engine supplier to them from 2028 onwards. With the sport actively showing more interest in captivating the American audience, adding another team, let alone a team that is reckoned to be one of the best in the United States that's been heavily backed by one of America's biggest car manufacturer could only improve Formula 1's growing fan base in the United States. The entry of Andretti Cadillac could only be a positive influence for the sport as everyone higher up in the sport seems to be more focused on the financial aspect of the sport that's compromising the soul of racing. I see Michael Andretti to be a person who's driven by passion for racing rather than viewing the sport as another money-making opportunity. Despite the hurdles to enter the sport, Michael Andretti is optimistic and persistent to make this work. The team has already built a 2023 spec car to run in the wind tunnel to develop their possible debut challenger and they have an engine partnership deal struck with Alpine for 2025. The entire project is also being spearheaded by former Lotus Renault technical director Nick Chester which shows how committed the team is to the sport even before they join it. The FIA governing body has green signaled the team's entry, but the team is stuck in the final stages of approval, which has to come from Stefano De Manacali and from the F1 teams. As they are not fond of 11th entry, as they believe the new team would take another pie of the prize money, which will reduce the overall prize money that's been distributed to all the Formula 1 teams. But with the growing appeal and the fan crowd that both Andretti and Cadillac have, I feel like the sport would thrive much better with their entry than not. It's it's very visible that the team's entry into the sport carries more benefits than cons that even a fan like me can recognize it. I wish the final stages of the approval gets granted so that we can have a proper American team on the grid that's been backed by an American giant. I would love to see an independent team like Andretti become a success story. After the Red Bull team, no independent team has challenged the front runners to become a formidable championship contenders. And I think Andretti has the minerals to become one and I would love to see that happen. With that being said, I would like to wrap up this video guys these are my thoughts and opinion on this whole situation and if you enjoy this video make sure to hit the like button and let me know down in the comments on what are your thoughts on this whole situation and how do you think Andretti would perform if they make it to Formula 1 I'm curious to know so put it down in the comments with that being said if you haven't subscribed to the Ren Master channel already make sure to hit that subscribe button and also hit that bell icon while you're at it so you get notified whenever I upload a brand new video and until next time it's me Vinish from Ren Master and I'm out love you guys stay safe peace Thank you.